G'day guys and welcome to another video. A while ago I did a video on um, what gets up my nose and how the card game community just grinds my gears with uh, the very very poor um, community standards and how they treat each other. Today is going to be another fuck you video and it is fuck you to the Gundam community. The people who watch the anime Gundam and talks about it. It is broken up in many factions and groups and elitist fucking mobs going on better because of story or whatever or age or era. And don't get me wrong, I am not attacking the uh, modeling community, though they do participate in this community. They're all just as bad. And one day, I will do something that will pick balls at the uh, modeling community because there are some things that do grind my gears, but at the moment, I don't wish to alienate people because I too am just as bad and I too, being the hypocrite I am, am involved in it. Now, a lot of people who watch Gundam or who don't know, you have the original series in the timeline of the Universal Century. And this continues over many, many shows and it's possibly the most beloved of them all. Uh, creatively, and I'm a strong... Um, fan of this is it breaks up into other parallel universes that are not related and they go into different technology stories characters and just universe lines and there's a number of them and over the years there has been uh, some very out there just sci-fi fucking weird shit and there's been some very geopolitical very interesting compelling stories where things got explanation and science behind it now, unfortunately, uh, a lot of people who are in the Universal Century are older gentlemen, except for the release of unicorns and new people going in. Uh, these, guys are, these guys are possibly the most elitist, and I am one of them. I'm one of these UC fans. And they will argue and argue from forum to forum, from website to website, you know, what shit, what's good, and bagging this shit out of two other series, namely... Seed and Wing. Seed is a much later series. It is uh, a completely different take. I don't know if they're, um, you know, dulling down the politicalness for more enjoyment from children or toy sales, though the story does get a bit limp and completely falls apart at the seams in the two story series. There's also major, major flaws in the character developments, especially the main character, Kira Jesus Yamato. Motherfucker just rapes and ravages everybody without killing a single soul. And as unrealistic in combat and war as that is, it pisses a lot of people off. You've just got constantly YouTube video comments, forums, fucking, you know, best motherfucker ever. Yeah, Kira, you know, fucking rape you or whatever. And people are like, oh, it's just like Jesus. And it is, oh, fuck. It just does my head in, pisses me off. I mean, you can have good conversations about, you know, the storyline settings and what you like and the artwork and the mobile suits and turning them to model kits and great conversations. And you could say, you know, I don't like Blast series because of, you know, these qualities. I like Blast series for those qualities. And if someone says, yeah, I disagree, I like this series, you know, better, it's like, hmm, you know, we're at odds. Oh, fuck what? No, some people are like, Oh no, fuck you, you're a retard. Why don't you like my series? The other series should just be destroyed. And it's just, it's, it's absolutely bullshit. And it's childish. Most of us are fucking grown men or teenagers or people heading into school. Get your fucking heads out of your asses. You're treating each other like shit. You're fucking, you know, driving some people out of the fun of the community. You know, we're meant to be sitting together around talking about fucking cartoons. And you're all taking it seriously, like real, bloody, political life. Ah, Face palm. Um, peace the fuck out. Again, fuck you to the Gundam community. I hate you all with a passion. Though, for some reason, a lot of you are still my colleagues. And that won't get between us. Catch you later.